work on it. Shit, I'm sorry. I trust him. Cookie though. Yeah, Thank you very maybe much. he'll sub, drop some bits, and then do it. Yeah. Oh, damn, that or would I'll really step it up. I wouldn't. Hey guys, good evening. Up. Boom, drop it. Boom, hitting him. Woo. You got me. Alright, so, buddies. What uh what kind of uh tabletop you all want to play today? What are you feeling? What kind of what kind of gym jam? I don't know, man. Is that for anything that isn't Secret Hitler? Are we doing... I'm okay with Red Dragon two? Inn. That's pretty slow and chill. Puzzles? Uh... Oh, shit. I actually finished the entire playlist of the R&B thing. Oh. Rockin'. My God. I never asked for this. I didn't either. Blue Salvation. Do you like waffles? Do you like pancakes? Do you like French toast? All of those things are good. Do you like waffles? Do you like waffles? Do you like pancakes? Do you like pancakes? Do you like Swiss cheese? Do I like Swiss cheese? Put them all together. Do, 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 do you get a way to get a mouthful? Mouthful, mouthful. Mouthful, mouthful. You know what, gang? I'm going to go through my, uh, my liked from radio list. It's a horrible list, I'm sure. It's got a lot of weird fucking songs on here. Are we going to the guilty pleasures? My own guilty pleasures. Oh shit! It starts off with Oh, it's the fall. Again. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Song. Everything fades away. Oh my god! Oh Christ! Yeah. Please don't, please don't look at the global chat on tabletop. Thank you. Oh. Oh no. Oh, oh no, that was. Oh. Please stop that. Why, dude? Stop that, dude. Why? Shit. Alright, I'll fuck. Hang on, I gotta hide the screen. <laughs> uh, let's see, so. Uh, what password is not taken? That we, like, no, password that is not actually, like, known to people. I'll put one in the fucking chat, dude. Hi, dude. That's a good password, my man. Try. Nice pass. Alright, it is up now with that password. So I just gotta see which game to play, though. Uh, let's see here. Sorry? You wanna play Sorry, dude? Sorry. Place is it even a good game? It's an Roll old shit. game. Or I guess that this is for taking cards. And then you would take your dude, right? I don't fucking know how this game works anymore, dude. Take the dude, right? What is this, seven? Yeah. What does that mean? You must either move one man forward seven squares or split the move between any two men. That sounds so too you, complicated. You no, no, listen, listen, listen. It's real fucking easy. Alright, what up? So if I drew that card, we're gonna draw one here. Eight. Okay. Must move one man forward eight spaces. So I take one of my mans. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh-huh. Now, alright? And then it'd be the next person's turn. But, let's say if I landed on this guy, right? Uh-huh. Oh shit. Looks like I'm so alive! Wow. If there's anybody in between this slide, they get knocked the fuck out back to stuck. Whoa! I believe also if, uh, okay. <laughs> I guess we're not playing. <laughs> Alright, what, what, what was the other rule? Uh, if you land on somebody, they're also knocked out. Okay. And we, Sorry. the object is to get all your pieces all around to the home. The home, and you have to land on the exact amount. That sounds frustrating. I don't know about that last rule, I kind of made that one up, but I'm pretty sure that's how it works. I know that's a rule for some you. game. There's a game like Marbles, it's the, pretty much essentially the same thing. Moncala? Hell yeah. I'm into that shit. Yeah, my texture's still loading, so um, you were saying that on a blank slate. <laughs> I'm not sure if Ivan's icon is safe for work. Oh, I can't actually what see happened? it, it's so small. Oh wow. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> God. <laughs> God. <laughs> God I mean, it's great it. that it's your face. God damn it, Ivan. And your bod. Totally forgot that. 
Oh, shit. What, did you put that on to fucking just go play Counter-Strike or something? Yeah, that's actually uh, for Counter-Strike. <laughs> I thought so. Like I said, it was no, not I was, I was playing with Rizka, look. so I, uh... <laughs> fucking look. Nah, that makes sense. Oh, shit. Alright, Chad, this is amorphous. Be kind. Oh, shit. Alright. You wanna play the Hyrule? Link to the past game? Yeah, tell me how to play, dude. Nope. Alright. Big. Whoa. Yeah, that's big. Who's there in the notebook? Battles. Warping. This looks pretty complicated. Looks like you gotta go around and get the fucking everything. Shit. Yeah. This looks really complicated. Holy fuck. Probably just as easy as Pokemon Master Trainer. Oh my gosh. Like, it looks like it could be fun, but it looks really like... Is this the entire game? I guess so. It's looking like it. Yeah, it even has light world and dark world. Encounter car. Alright, what's an encounter car look like? Ball and chain trooper. Oh, snap. Oh, if you win, you get rupees or plus three heart. If you lose, you get minus four heart. Fuck, how do you decide if you win or lose? Uh, probably... Flying tiles? I hate die it, here. This looks like it could be cool, but I think we definitely have to like invest in learning. <gasps> I got the What about power. that one Fuck like off. that Dead by Winter game? I mean we could, but I think we need one more, don't we? It's a five person game or four? I don't remember. Uh I mean it's five yeah, is the but... limit, yeah. Oh, I mean shit. I'm we sorry. need five. It's a necessity. Oh, we need one more person. We will get torn out. Or torn up by those fucking whatever they're called, the daily fucking quest. Ugh, we're yeah, dead. dude, the dailies, dude. The fuck us up, dude. Or weeklies, or whatever you call uh, them. Christ. Frick. Oh, there is a Dark Souls board game too. There is. You just wanna, I don't know how to play it. You want to learn the Dark Souls board game? Teach me. Ah, uh, fuck. I'm really bad at like explaining things to people. The only thing I gotta say, I did not play a board game. It is game. right there, actually. It's right there. Damn, I don't want to like play a board game to like teach me cry. I understand. Mm. Nope. So you don't actually <laughs> want to play the board game then? Oh no, I'll, I'm down. Oh man, this looks fucking dope, and it's four player. Oh shit! I'll invade you. I wonder if it's actually good. Well, let's play it. it. Hi guys, just out. a little yeah. bit about much love lesson three. Tutorials. That's how you do it. Thank you very much, Connor. That was very sweet, of you, buddy. Shit, I'm I'm gonna try it out. Fuck it, I'm subscribing. Shit. You can be full of love without bitch. Just saying. That's true. And just babes. saying, my dude. And Spectrum ninety one. Thank you guys. All right, let's go ahead. Dark Souls board thing. I uh, found the tutorial, guys. It's 46 minutes. For the Dark Souls board game? Yeah. Oh, shit, really? A 46-minute yeah. tutorial? Probably explains, like, right, every guys, fucking all scenario. Uh, this looks like it could be really fun, though. Yeah, I'll be the knight, for sure. Good I want to be the here. assassin. Thank you. This is cool-looking. 46 minute video. Are we listen to this, dudes? I mean, I'm fucking down. You guys want to learn how to play the Dark Souls board game, everybody? We'll, we'll invest, dude. We'll fucking learn. Let me look at the notebook construction, see how complicated that looks before. All right. Thing. Let me know the, what it, you guys want like, to do. The rules here are two pages long at most. Okay. How he stretched that to 46 minutes is beyond me. Maybe he had to like go over his like, entire collection of games beforehand. But I think a Dark Souls board game would be really fun to play. You know, dude? I think you know. I think you know. Dude, this is mm. a huge investment. Gatekeeper Squall, thank you. Alright, so wait, where's this? Uh, the, where's the notebook you're looking at, Russ? 
Tell me I don't know, I opened up notebook and it's talking about solitaire. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's talking about solitaire. So I'm learning how to play solitaire while this goes on. I think the guy who made this, the base game was solitaire, he just fucking tweaked it out. Alright, well there's also this book here. STB, he owns it? I mean, I'm sure he's asleep by now. 100%. No, actually... I just saw the thing. Sit state. Okay. Whoa! The actual book is in here too, dude! That's fucking pretty looking. Oh god, 21 pages. Yeah. Oh, dude. Dude. I really, 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 really want to play. Can we play, please? Yeah, sure, man. Just tweet to me how to play. All right, let's watch that video. This is gonna be really well, this cool. is like the actual board game. That's yeah. the only one that was on there. Yeah, we can learn it from this, I'm sure. All right, everybody, pull up that video. We're going in. We're going in, baby. I'm sure we can, like, learn, get the gist of it um, before the entire 46 minutes are up. Maybe. You know? All right, so let me know when you all have the video set up. Oh, here's the rule book. Put that bitch to zero seconds. Because we're not going to read all that. We know that. It's, we're not going to watch the whole video either, I'm sure. We just got to get the gist of how to play this. Or we can watch his unboxing video, whichever you want to do. Wow. Are right, you guys ready? Sure. Uh, Snake and Ivan? Yeah, yeah. Alright, say the shit. Three, two, one, go. Teach. Welcome, me. chosen undead. Hey. The Dark Souls, the board game tutorial. I like them already. There are two modes of play in Dark Souls, the board Getting game. Getting ASMR right now. Yeah. A regular play of Dark Souls, the board game, consists of fighting one mini boss and then one main boss. Okay. If the players can defeat the main boss, they have won the game. Alternatively, you could set it up for campaign, which follows most of the same rules, although it might require players to fight more than one mini boss before fighting a main boss. I'll explain the game for regular play. Okay. And at the end of the video, we'll talk about how rules can change for the campaign mode. I think we'll just do regular. Game, you need to gather your collection of tiles and set aside the bonfire tile. Uh huh. The mini boss tile and the boss tile. Okay. Shuffle the remaining tiles and draw four of them. You didn't really shuffle that very good. Yeah, a lot of fucking tiles, dude. Come up slack. <laughs> or however many are in your collection. These things are heavy as plates. <laughs> now place your bonfire tile on the table and take the four tiles you pulled cool from the collection set up, though. and yeah. align them to the bonfire tile in any orientation. Okay, so that's kind of like, um... These tiles are never sighted. Oh, dope. Hill in the mansion or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'd like. As long as you align them against other doorways. Okay, that's cool. Once you've placed all your tiles, take the fog gate token and place it along an open doorway on the tile that is farthest from the bonfire. Oh, that's dope. So Beyond that's where the boss is. Is where the mini boss nah. or main boss will be. <sighs> then take the spark dial counter and set it to the appropriate number for the number of players. I'll set this up for three players. So I'm going to need to set it to three. Okay. For four players, it would be two. We're going to be having two, two sparks. Four, and for one player, it would be five. And you can place it on the bonfire tile. And then you must select the boss which you're going to face. If this is the first game in your session, you must select a mini boss first. After making your selection, you must gather all the appropriate cards and models for that boss. Every boss will have a model. Do we have cool models too? Counter dial, behavior cards, as well as heat up behavior cards, as they have the heat up symbol on them, uh -huh. a main stat card, and a number of legendary treasures associated with them. Oh, dude, the halberd, dude. Gather all these cards. And set them off to the side but keep the main stack card out for now okay you'll then need to populate the dungeon with encounters encounters are separated by level you have a level one level two and level three encounter deck 
so be sure to shuffle the encounter decks by level and draw a number of random cards from them equal to the number at the bottom of your boss's stat card. The gargoyle here requires that I draw three level one encounters and one level two encounters. Okay. You can then return. Gargoyle's not a mid boss. He is now. To the box. Then, without looking at them, place one encounter in each tile on the board, placing the lowest level encounters closest to the bonfire before placing higher level encounters. Okay. And now players can choose their character. Each character will have a punch out board that has unique stats and a unique heroic action. When you select your character, which I'll refer to as Zero from now on, you're going to need to gather a me. assist token, mm. a heroic action token, and a luck token. We already have those set. As I've just done, and put them in their ready state. Their unready state has an unilluminated side, so you can tell the difference. Okay. Each character also has associated starting cards. You can tell a card is a starting card by the different backs, and in the top right, there will not be a treasure box icon. You may, of course, equip these immediately. Only oh. one card can go to your character's body slot and separate hand slots. Do you think we should wait? Uh, we should pause here three and set it up for what we've yes, seen so far? Shields count as weapons. I already have all that set up. Any weapons? Yeah. Not I guess you mean the tiles and shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This slot yeah. I guess so. Here, let's, all right, let's pause so now. Good. It's at 450 on the time. Yeah, let's actually uh, do Where that. Where are the now. tiles? Um... Somewhere. There's the encounters. Uh, let's see. Wait, tiles? Please. Oh, yeah. I think I already. Yep. Shuffle it. Oh, yeah. We should shuffle it. You're right. Oh, God. Spoilers. Wait, did I put it in there? I might have put it in the wrong thing. Yeah, we did. We did. Oh, frick. Yeah, those. Move the hold, yeah. Yeah. Whoa. I was moving the bag. Popping back in there. I will shuffle it. We gotta shuffle it. I never asked for this. I fucking did. I choose Fuck this one. Alright, I have a good one, TRG. Alright, I choose this one. Snake and Ivan, you gotta choose one. Ooh, this one's cool looking. Somewhere now. Ah, uh, just right here. Bag in the middle. Let's pull it out. Nice. Alright, so now we gotta just set the tiles up. Um, We just needed four, right? Yeah, that'd make five. Okay. okay. And done. Nice. Oh wait. Um. Yeah, this will work. We just gotta do it like this. I locked them. Oh wait, no, you're right. You're right. You're good. You're good. I'm dumb. Don't mind me. You locked them. Good locking. So we need to put our fog wall uh, right here or there, whichever. And then uh, we got to set up the um, the boss. We need our sparks. We need two sparks. True. We do need.
I don't know. I'm looking. Uh, what does that do? Oh. Uh, those are traps. Fuck. Uh, hmm. More music. Um, all day. This is spicy. Dude, I fucking know, right? It sounds really complicated to set up, but I think if we actually commit and get it set up, it'll be, it'll be worth it. The cards are already on. Oh, are they? Oh, they're right here. Okay. I never asked for this. Oh, okay. Okay, so... How does this work exactly? Do we, like, shuffle them all together, or what? Like, are they supposed to be right here? I don't think so. Captain Kid, thank you. Uh... What about the, like, you mentioned, yeah, the little symbol. Okay. Perverting gameplay we did. Thank you, my man. Trying our best. Watching more of the video, you didn't get past the finding the cards. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Alright, uh, I guess we'll, uh, just keep watching. Yeah, let me put my dude by the campfire. Yeah. It's kind of important. There we go. Chilling. Alright, nice. Oh. Is this the item? Yep. What's up? Where? Right here. Right oh, there. right there? Okay. Oh, there they are. Do we gotta put our cards in there? No. Okay. We are bringing the five other cards with us. Oh, there's like, they're already with us. That's what he said, at least. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready to hit play. Interesting. Alright, well, alright. Let's get this shit done. Alright. You guys ready at 6.04? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. After you defeated a mini boss. So if you're setting this up after you've defeated the mini boss, only then will you shuffle in the five transposed items. And if you've already defeated the mini boss and are setting up to fight your main boss, locate the generic legendary treasure cards, shuffle it, randomly deal five, and shuffle them into your treasure deck because you'll need greater treasures in order to take out the main boss. I'll be honest, I don't know what they mean. So after shuffling your treasure deck, place it onto the treasure chest space on the bonfire tile here. Okay, that's a huge deck. And now that. you're ready to begin. If okay. you're playing as a solo hey, hey, hey. if we're ready to begin, we should probably pause you're now. you're the only one entering this adventure. Yeah, pause. All right, so it looks like we do got to shuffle because that deck that was a big deck. That, I mean, that's a big deck right there, but too. That was after the mid boss, he said. Uh, that's yeah. That's when we shuffle ours in. Yeah. Okay, but he, he shoved it in right there, right? Didn't he? He said. He did after the legendaries. The okay. Fuck. All right. Um, if that's the case, then we do have it set up now? So, like, wait. When, when do we use these? These cards here that we have? I don't know, there's five we're bringing with us, and I think five are better treasures that we're to, uh, put into the deck. Mm. I don't know about that part. So many symbols. I do, I, I do see, alright, so in the top right, there's a treasure chest, that's the normal shit, and right. there's a treasure chest with the blue light, I think that's the legendaries he was talking about. Oh, okay, okay, I can get that, gotcha. Alright, so the normal shit. The whites, because the you're the supposed white. to be able to play this with you know by yourself. Yeah. Okay. So each character is bringing five shit with them, and then five legendaries, I guess. Okay. And I don't know if we put in five legendaries into the deck right now or what. That part I kind of missed. I think we do that after a mid boss or any kind of boss. We put the legendary ones in. I could be wrong. Though. I don't know, because there's a, there's sixty cards.